So, Arsenal are linked with absolutely everybody you can think of. Mbappe, Lacazette, Lamar, Kovacic, some kid from Juventus. We're going to chase after all these so-called targets, apparently. People are going to believe every single story they see in the newspapers because they're deluded. It happens year after year after year. When are you lot, like, seriously, going to stop believing these bullshit fake ITK accounts on Twitter and all these stupid journalists that are paid to make up bullshit? You know, if, if you actually analysed, say, just John Cross as an example, because he's the biggest mong out there. Right? If you take out all of John Cross's articles from last summer, where he said we were going to sign X, Y and Z, and then go and actually have a look how many of them we actually signed, it's probably about 0.1%. Yet every summer, people fall for it again. What's the matter with you lot? We ain't signing nobody of any note. You know, we're going to apparently chase after Mbappe and Lacazette all summer. You know, well, Aubameyang's available, Morata's available, Icardi's available. Could carry on, I could carry on with names, you know, and at the end of the day, it's going to end up that we start the first Premier League game of the season at home to Leicester with Olivier Giroud up front or Danny Welbeck up front. You know that, I know that, every Arsenal fan knows that. The difference is, I say it. Whereas others sit and live in hope. There is no hope. At the end of the day, I've seen this summer after summer after summer after summer. You know, look, look at the season when we signed Mesut Ozil. That was the only decent signing of any note that we made that summer. And when did we make it? Deadline day. You know, there's still about 70 odd days of this transfer window left. Obviously, it hasn't officially opened. Um, although you are not not allowed to sign players you can still sign players it's just not official until the 1st of July but you now when you look at the likes of Everton going out spunking 60 million quid already or whatever it is and, and Man City have done well 75 or whatever they've spent you know yeah sitting here as an Arsenal fan we all know what's coming oh well um, I tried to sign him once fuck off mate at the end of the day all these people that tell me yeah but he's not available this person's not available. Let me tell you something. Every single player in world football, regardless of their contract, is available. Because the contract ain't worth shit. If you pay what is required to the club to get that player, and then pay that player what he wants, you will get that player. So, for example, um, Lacazette. If, if they want 60 million... And you want the player badly, you'll pay 60 million. If he wants 200 grand a week, and like I said, you want the player properly, and you're definitely, it's an upgrade. And in my opinion, it is an upgrade on Giroud. I've seen a lot of people telling me that it's not an upgrade on Giroud. What, la what land are you living in? Because Giroud went 15 games without a goal the season before last. Lacazette don't do that shit. So if you want the player, you pay the fucking money.